Welcome back to Freaky Funko Friday. Guys, I got some badass information to give you. Um, welcome to all my freaks. I couldn't wait to get home from work and make this video and get this out as soon as possible because Funko is playing a trick on us when it comes to the Ant-Man and the Wasp. And if you follow me and you watch these videos, you are one of the few people that get a sneak peek at something that you cannot find on Google, on Yahoo, search images, pop price guide. You ain't going to find these anywhere. I looked. You might get lucky, but I couldn't find any. I looked for about 20 minutes. I'm about to show you two new Funko Pops that are being released for the Ant-Man and the Wasp. And they're not necessarily new. When I did my Ant-Man and the Wasp video, these two Funko Pops were not announced by Funko. Okay? Here is Ant-Man. I've already picked up Ant-Man. We saw that in another video. Look in the back. Okay? Got the Wasp, Ghost, and Ant-Man. So guess what? I got Ant-Man. Got the ghost. Live them to the back. You get the same three. I even got Ant-Man Chase. Flip them to the back. Now we know Ghost has a Walmart exclusive, translucent. Okay? So that one's not popping up on here because it's an exclusive. Usually exclusives do not pop up. So today, I go to um, GameStop and the long-awaited, sought-after, and the box isn't even in that great of a shape, so I'm going to buy another one, but I had to get her because I told you she's my favorite, the Wasp. So here's the Wasp, and the box is okay. I mean, it's an okay condition. It's got some, like, yellow gunk here. I'm not sure what that is. I'm going to try to clean that off, but... Anyways, I couldn't pass her up. I mean, she's on the shelf. I had to get her. Okay? Same three on the back. Now, so I have the wasp. So I just need the wasp chase, and I need the ghost translucent from Walmart. Now, there are two more Funko Pops, not on the back, and they're not exclusives, okay? But Funko, they're hiding something from us. And I'm about to let you know what that is. So, uh, I don't consider it a spoiler. Um, so, I don't feel like I'm spoiling anything for you as far as the movie goes. But, guys, man, this is just... I mean, I'm into Funko so much, and I, I lucked out today. I was going to purchase three pops today from Ant-Man and the Wasp. I did get the Wasp. The other two, when they rang it up, it said hold until July 13th so I could not take them home. So they have them on hold for me. They put my name on it. They put them in a special place. They're not going to sell them. They can't sell these until July 13th. But I can tell you right now that is the official drop date for these two pops I'm going to show you. And I'm excited for these two pops, number one, because they were not featured anywhere by Funko. Funko's website, Funko Price Guide, Pictures of, you can type these in in Google, search, you're not going to find them. I didn't find them. Thank God I was smart enough when I reluctantly, almost in tears, had to hand these back to the associate at GameStop and say, okay, can you hold them for me? And they're going to hold them for me because they know me. I'm a frequent shopper there. These are not exclusives, okay? But I did take pictures of them because I wanted to share them with you. And I'm glad I did. Um, to share them with you today on this video. So this is an Ant-Man and the Wasp update on the Funko Pops. So here we go. Guys, I hope you're ready, man. This is phenomenal. And I know I'm a geek and I nerd out about this stuff and I get super pumped up and you're probably like, yeah, that's cool. And I'm just like, oh my God. You know, but that's me. I'm a collector. I love this stuff. And um, I'm always passionate about Funko Pops, especially when... There's going to be things that happen in the movie that 
probably Ant-Man and the Wasp and Funko discussed and said, well, if you release this pop, that's going to give them a hint of what's going to happen to a movie and maybe spoil it for you. I don't consider this a spoiler just because somebody's going to dress up in a costume. But I'm going to show them to you anyways because I want you to say you've seen it here first with me. Funko, right here. Freaky Funko Friday with your boy Anthony. So here we go. Guys, this is awesome. All right. So you guys should know who Hank Pym is, right? There's a picture of his character. It looks familiar. You know who his daughter is. I hope you know who his daughter is. If you haven't seen it, go watch Ant-Man in the, the first Ant-Man movie. Um, so here is Hank Funko Pop dressed up. In the, I'm going to call it the Ant-Man uh, costume. So here's Hank Fim, Funko Pop number 343. You're not going to find this picture anywhere as June 27th. Funko Pop Pice Guide, doesn't matter where you go. You're not going to find this picture anywhere else but here. Bam! Number 343, Hank Fim dressed up as the Ant-Man. Guys, if you don't realize how awesome this is, something's crazy with you, man. Because this is phenomenal. This is something that Funko is definitely hiding. And they do this quite often, by the way, just so you know. And I'm not mad at anybody. I'm actually excited that they didn't put these on the box. They didn't let nobody know that these were dropping. So, I, man, I was this close. I mean, I had my debit card ready to purchase. And they told me I couldn't get them. Or they would get in trouble for selling them early. They put them on the shelves early by mistake. Look at Hank. Look at Hank in this. Oh my God. Like, guys, he looks so awesome. I mean, you can even see his glasses. And, you know, through the red visor there. That's Hank, man. He, he, he dresses up in this movie. In that costume. And he obviously plays a role. Um you know, in the Ant-Man and the Wasp, more than just his, you know, normal role. Guys, I'm pumped, man. This is awesome. Like, again, I cannot stress to you enough, this picture is nowhere to be found on the internet. I have it here. Just for you. Just another reason why you should watch, follow, subscribe, because I try to give the newest information as soon as I find it, and man, is this a big-time bombshell drop right here. So if you're collecting the entire series like I am and you're a huge fan of Ant-Man and you're, you just are super pumped about Ant-Man and the Wasp, this Funko Pop should just be blowing your mind right now, guys. So I'm bringing it to you here first. Hank Fim, dressed up as the Ant-Man. So, I got another bombshell for you. Janet Van Dyne. Funko Pop number 344. That's her character in the movie. So that's her normal, you know, her normal view in the movie. And this is her Funko Pop. Only here. Nowhere else on the internet. Can't find it anywhere. Only here. Because I took a picture of it in the store. <laughs> number 344, Janet Van Dyne dressed up. I want to say in the Ant-Man... She doesn't like she has the full costume on. She looks like she has a helmet on. And she definitely has some type of weapon in her hand um, that I'm sure she can, you know, shrink down or make large. I, Even when I looked at it through the box, I couldn't tell uh, what kind of weapon that was. Um, so I don't know. You guys can definitely put in the comments below what you think that is. But man, oh man, oh man. This is awesome. So it goes right in line. I mean, the I'm just looking here on the side here. So the Ant-Man is number 340. The Chase is 340 of him. You got the Wasp 341. The Chase of hers 341. You got 342 of Ghost. 342 of Ghost, translucent Walmart exclusive that I haven't found yet. It's not. I have, I've been to a lot of Walmarts. It hasn't been released. It's not supposed to until July. But again, these are being released early, right? So you got 340, 341, 342... 343, Hank, 344, Janet. 
goes right in line. And these are not exclusives, by the way. This is not a GameStop exclusive. These are just hidden Funko Pops that Funko made that no one knows about. Well, very few people know about. And now you do for subscribing, for watching my videos. Guys, I'm excited. I'm glad I have these two on hold. I'm going to assume because they're not on the back of the box that they're making a limited amount of these. I don't know, but I'm just going to assume they're going to be a limited amount of these being made because they're not the main characters, right? Ant-Man and the Wasp, they're not the main characters that people are going to be out there buying. So I don't know how many they're going to make, but I tell you what, got to get your hands on these. July 13th is when I can go pick this up at 10 a.m. when that store opens, that GameStop opens. And I will be there at 10 a.m. on... July 13th to get these so I hope you enjoyed the update um, there's Comic Con updates I gotta give you guys but this came first man and just so you know July 13th falls on a Friday so it'll be Friday the 13th how about that in July Woo, guys I'm excited man this is awesome so here we go this is the update for you all just wanted to make this quick video um, and uh, that's pretty awesome so thanks for watching be nice to one another. Check out my, check out all my videos if you haven't seen them. And uh, I am definitely coming out with the part two or the part three. Actually, now the part four of the uh, Comic-Con exclusives that keep being dropped. Got to make another video of those. So um, uh, that'll be coming. In case you're wondering, I served. This is a great shirt. Thank you, Under Armour, um, for, and it has the American flag on this side. Absolutely love this shirt. Um, I'm a U.S. Air Force veteran, so I have served my country proudly. And um, when I saw the shirt, I had to get it because I was like, wow, that's awesome. So um, support Under Armour. They're not paying me for this, but um, I was definitely in the Air Force, um, served my country, so I'm an Air Force veteran. And so just want to share that with you. Um, if you see this and you've served, first of all, thank you for serving our country. Um, that means a lot to me as a, as a former, um, you know, uh, Air Force Airman, uh, who served my country as well. So thank you if you've served your country, uh, definitely thank you for your sacrifice. Thank you for serving the country. Thank you for, for helping make this beautiful country free, um, cause freedom isn't free. It comes at a high cost and a lot of people don't realize that. And when you serve this country, you realize what that cost is. So... Um, to all the veterans out there, thank you. To all the current active duty, thank you so much for serving your country, um, for serving our country. Uh, and I can't thank you enough for that. So um, I want to end the video on that. God bless you guys. Take care, and I'll see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.